it going guys, Sharblox here. In this video, we are going to be talking about old Roblox. Not too old though, only back in time five years to 2016. It seems recently that this era of Roblox has become a lot more popular. I suppose people are starting to find it more nostalgic. I keep on seeing tweets on my Twitter homepage about 2016 Roblox, people talking about the events, people talking about the website's design, all of that kind of stuff. A few people are saying that 2016 was so much better. They basically think it's better than 2021. I had temporarily quit Roblox at that point, so to be honest, I can't exactly confirm it. But to be fair, 2016 wasn't really that exciting. I mean, tickets were removed. I don't remember any good events. Oh, I think the 2016 egg hunt was pretty good, but apart from that, nothing that exciting. Even if it was better than 2021, well, it wouldn't have been better by a lot. It does seem a little mad to me that people are nostalgic over 2016, but I guess most players from the previous years have stopped playing already. It's pretty rare now to join a game and see someone from 2009 or 2010. But anyway, the topic of this video is how to get 2016 Roblox back. Well, to the best of our ability anyway. We don't have time travel or time machines, but we do have some plugins and games to revive the 2016 experience. Okay, so over on my Roblox profile, as you guys can see, this is just the normal 2021 version of Roblox. If you guys do want to get the 2016 Roblox theme back, what you guys want to do is go ahead and click on the gear icon and then go into your Roblox settings. Now once you're inside of your Roblox settings you want to scroll down on the main page and you want to go to the personal tab. Basically in here under theme we want to change it to light. Now it might already be on light already. If you had it on dark then simply just change it to light and go ahead and just save it. And then that's it. You're pretty much done. You can go back to your profile and now what we need to do is install the 2016 Roblox theme. Now I'm going to leave a link to this in this video's description but what you guys want to do is go over to the Google Chrome web store and you see this app right here it's called stylus we want to get this don't get this one stylus beta that one looks a little bit dodgy we're going to get the most popular one this one has got 400,000 users and 800 reviews as you can see the reviews are pretty good 4.5 stars out of 5 not too bad and basically what this application lets us do is install any theme for any website and of course we are going to get the 2016 Roblox theme so let's just go ahead let's click on add to chrome add extension like i said i'm going to link this in the video's description and when it's finished it will come up like this stylus has been added to chrome there you go as easy as that now i just want to say this quickly this extension called stylish don't get these two confused because this one is actually a little bit dodgy i know it's got two million users like this thing is very famous it's very popular but at one point it was actually banned off the google chrome store because apparently it was like collecting people's data via like spyware or something like that so yeah don't install this one this one seems a little bit dodgy many people have complained about it make sure to go ahead and get the other one stylus because this one is safe also in this video's description i'm going to leave a link to this roblox in 2016 yes this is the roblox theme for 2016 roblox so let's click on install style and then it's going to pop up saying install roblox 2016 into stylus and then there you go it's as easy as that it should now be installed and now guys back on the roblox website all you want to do is simply refresh the page and then look at this we have got the 2016 roblox theme and it's actually pretty cool even like the games page the avatar shop has been renamed to catalog look at this the games page even looks like how it used to look that's kind of cool the nice thing with this theme is it does still have some of like the newer roblox features but it still looks like 2016 so yeah i saw many people tweeting about this many people were talking about this over on twitter i saw loads of comments of people asking like how to get this how did they do it so i thought well i might as well just make a quick video showing you guys how to get it if you enjoyed roblox 2016 with the 2016 theme selected here is what the roblox avatar shop looks like okay we've gone back in time so now it's the catalog yep the catalog how i used to prefer it hang on a second is this all of the old roblox stuff why am i being recommended all of this old stuff that's actually pretty cool i don't think that's anything to do with the plugin but there you go wow i even forgot about loads of these items yeah i don't think that's something to do with this plugin but to be honest that's pretty cool also guys let me quickly show you the avatar editor so yep kind of looks like the 2016 theme as well it looks pretty cool it looks better than the um 2020 theme i guess actually i don't know which one do you prefer let me know down below in the comment section i think this one kind of like outlines like accessories a bit more so maybe they show up a bit easier maybe it's easier to see like what you're about to wear on your avatar but anyway let me know your opinion down below and of course guys we can play some 2016 themed games as well 
just like this one, Murder Mystery 2. This one is the 2016 edition. I tell you what guys, I will leave a link to all of these games in the video's description as well. Maybe if you're playing Roblox at this time, you will remember these games. They were like classics. These games were so popular when they came out back in 2016. We also have an excellent adventure. This came out that year as well. Now it's a legacy version, so it still works. You can still get the badges and all of that kind of stuff. You just don't get prizes, but it's still pretty cool to just play it and check it out. If you suddenly decide that you don't want this theme running anymore, what you can actually do is just click on the puzzle piece icon. Go ahead and just click on stylus. And as you can see at the top, Roblox in 2016 is selected. Well, what you can actually do is unselect this. And as you can see, the theme goes back to normal. So there you go. It's as easy as that. You can enable it again if you want to. And yeah, this plugin is actually quite nice. You can get some pretty cool themes. If you want, you can pretty much get like any theme you want to. There's so many pages. I will leave a link to this in the video's description as well. And before I forget, if you guys would like to completely delete this extension, so like just completely remove it, just go up to the three dots here, click on that, scroll down, go to more tools, and then go to extensions. And from here, you can find it and just simply remove it. And then you just click on remove. And then there you go. It's literally gone. And there we have it, guys. How to get 2016 Roblox back. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. And I will see you guys in the next one.